Hi, it's Joe from SuppleMcClarity.com. So telomere length is often seen as a sign of biological cellular aging and disease, but is there anything we can do about it? Yes. In this video, I'm going to show you several ways to help your telomeres grow again that do not require any dietary supplements. Let's start by talking about weight loss. So here we have a study where 42 overweight people were undergoing weight loss surgery. Actually, the, uh, what they used here was the gastric balloon technique. And the researchers noted that when they took blood samples before and six months later, they wanted to see what would happen to their telomeres. Well, turns out that of the 37 people who actually completed the study, the researchers found that the greater the weight loss, the greater the degree of telomere elongation. Yeah, those telomeres actually got longer. In addition, this telomere elongation effect was even greater in those who started out with the shortest telomeres. So the shorter the telomeres they started off with in baseline, the longer their telomeres appeared to get. Other studies have also shown that weight loss surgery lengthens telomeres, such as this one here where people were followed between three and five years after they had their weight loss surgery. So that's great for weight loss surgery, but what about weight loss, just weight loss from say dieting, can that help as well? Yeah. In this study, 45 men were put on a three month long calorie restricted diet. Basically they reduced their calories by 30% of what they normally were used to eating. One thing I wanted to point out here is the gain in telomere length appeared to be greater the more weight they lost and the more body fat they lost. So the more they lost, whether it's just weight or body fat, the longer their telomeres appeared to get. And again, it didn't appear to be related to an increase in that telomerase enzyme. Again, speculating that perhaps maybe there's a different mechanism going on here. So weight loss absolutely appears to increase length in telomeres. What about exercise? Absolutely. Here we have an investigation of almost 6,000 men and women showing that physically active people have longer telomeres than those people who are less active. In fact, the researchers noted that in people who exercise regularly, they were on average nine years younger at the cellular level than those who did not exercise. That's pretty impressive. But I know what you're thinking. What about the age old question? What's better, strength or cardio? Well, we have this investigation where 124 healthy but inactive people were put on different exercise programs for six months. And in case you're wondering, here they are. They have a control group that basically does nothing. They have another group that does, that does aerobic endurance training, running, a HIT group, high intensity interval training group, and then a strength training group. So what did they find? So good news if you like cardio and HIIT training, both aerobic exercise and high intensity interval training increase telomere length and the telomerase enzyme, that's good. However, not so good for strength training. Resistance training did not lengthen telomeres or increase the telomerase enzyme. So good news if you like cardio. Strength training, again, has other benefits. I do think more research is necessary to see the effects of resistance training and telomeres. So I personally don't think this is the end of the story. But speaking of exercise, what about other types of exercise like, for instance, yoga? Yeah, yoga. So here we have an investigation of 96 people that participated in a three-month yoga and meditation program. And while the researchers noted that many improvements in oxidative stress and antioxidant capacity, they did improve, when it came to telomeres, they actually stopped short and said that telomere length, it did increase, but it wasn't clinically significant. Now, that doesn't mean that yoga and meditation can't help because you can see from this study, other anti-aging factors did improve. So if you like yoga and meditation, I would say keep doing it. Now, so much for exercise. What about food? Well, most Americans don't eat enough fiber, but maybe this study can help change that. Here's an investigation showing that on average, every one gram of fiber increases telomere length by 8.3 base pairs. If you could increase your fiber intake by 10 grams, well, that's gonna increase your telomere length by about 83 base pairs, and on average, this will mean you're about five and a half years younger. 
So fiber, good, you gotta eat it. They actually concluded here, significant fiber consumption accounts for longer telomeres and less biological aging than lower fiber intake. So yay for fiber. Other studies have mentioned that specific types of foods can also play a role in telomere length. What foods are they? Well, we've got nuts, beans, seaweed. If you like seaweed, that's good. Whole grains, fruits, dairy foods, mushrooms. Yeah, mushrooms. I'll actually link to my other video on mushrooms in the description so you can check out the research on mushrooms and telomeres. Coffee. Yeah, coffee apparently appears to be length, linked to greater telomere length as well. And also vegetables. Yeah, eating veggies is also associated with longer telomeres as well. On the flip side, however, foods linked to shorter telomeres, in other words, those foods that'll make your telomeres shorter, they include red and processed meats, alcohol, and sugar. And I'm not talking about the sugar that's in food naturally. I mean the added sugars that's added to foods to make them taste better. So eat more healthy foods, cut back on the not so healthy foods, they might have an additive effect. Now, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, is there some special diet out there that may lengthen telomeres? And I would say, well, there is some evidence that the Mediterranean diet may be associated with longer telomeres, but honestly, I don't think the research is there yet. I think we need better studies. But if you like eating the Mediterranean diet style, I would say more power to you. There's a tremendous amount of other healthy research on the Mediterranean diet. So there you have it, several non-dietary supplement ways to lengthen your telomeres. Did I miss any? Leave a comment below and let me know. Until next time, I'm Joe from supplementclarity.com. Take care.